Hey guys, my name is Janie. Today I want to talk to you guys about some supplements that I use for fat loss, muscle gaining, and just health in general that you guys might want to try. So let's take a look. So I've done an entire video on the apple cider vinegar that I take, mix it with lemon juice and a little bit of cinnamon in warm water. Drink that, helps with sugar cravings. Then I'm gonna go over the rest. Okay, so this is my vitamin that I take. So I think everyone should take like a multivitamin. Just because a lot of the times we don't get all the nutrients we need from our food because most of us don't eat supremely healthy. So this is what I take. It's the Alive Multivitamin Max Potency, but it also has like all the greens in it, which is why I like to get it. So it has a ton of fruits and a ton of veggies. So let's, let me just zoom in on it here. Okay, it has all that and then the whole vitamins, it's bomb. I will say it has a very strong taste. Almost gag worthy, but not quite. So, just warning you, it's like super thick and grain. Like, see in there. But it makes you feel good. It makes you feel alive. Next up, I've got these I ordered off Amazon. So, it's biotin for hair, skin, and nails. Because I'm trying to get my hair, you know, growing a little bit more. Most of this is. Well, like half of this is fake, just so you know. My real hair is like that. And these are hair extensions. Not gonna lie about it. So I've been taking that. Evening Primrose Oil, which is supposed to be really good for female hormones, for your skin, for your hair. It's supposed to balance everything out. So that's what I'm trying that for. Black Seed Oil. So uh, this is like an alternative to fish oil um, because it has all your omega threes in it. So it has, so omega threes, thirteen hundred milligrams. This one's really really good for you. It supports heart health, a bunch of other great stuff. That's it for the vitamins. So let's go into some supplements. So I've got this collagen peptides. So I was watching other YouTubers and just reading stuff on the internet about how collagen is really good for your skin and your joints and just like just your digestive system and everything so it says on here supports bone and joint health builds muscle and fitness supports balanced diet enhances skin hair and nails promotes a healthy immune system who don't want that and it has a fast absorption rate it has a big amino acids profile. There's like a ton of them. I'm gonna say the taste on this, it doesn't really have a taste. It just, I don't know, it's unflavored. I just put it in like my pre-workout drink usually, but it has a smell. This smell is like, oof. I put it in this shaker and then I like, I take a sniff. But you can't taste it. It's really weird. But you can smell it as you're bringing it up. And then you just like hold your breath and drink it. So I listened to this podcast about your gut health and Dr. Zach Bush. So I listened to his podcast on the Shalene show. I think it was the Shalene, Shalene show. One of her podcasts, like Shalene Johnson's podcast. All about gut health and how basically all of our food has been poisoned with the weed killer Roundup, it's glyphosate, this is the chemical in it, that destroys our gut bacteria. Which is why a lot of us have a lot of issues. Especially now because they spray it on all of our food and then even if you buy organic, it's still in the soil because it evaporates up into the clouds and rains back down. And one of the things it takes away is our minerals that are in the soil. So this is just like a full mineral thing and they found some place in the middle of the desert, desert like Death Valley or something in that area where it barely rains and they dug deep, deep, deep down into the soil and found all the minerals that were missing in our soil that have been destroyed. 
that is this. That was like a quick, brief overview, but um, it talks about how you get your, I don't know, people talk about leaky gut all the time. Well, this is supposed to help with leaky gut. So the tight junctions, you're just gonna have to listen to his podcast. It's fascinating, but I'm gonna zoom in on that. That's your little gut lining and you want it to be closed. You don't want them to be seeping out into your system. Three times a day, it's good. So I got magnesium oil. And so this helps with better sleep, improved skin, stress relief, joint relief, anti-aging benefits, and boosting energy. So I spray this on my feet at night and it helps me get like a deeper sleep. And then if I have sore muscles from like when I'm working out, I spray it on wherever that is. So like leg day, I'll spray it on my hamstrings, my quads, whatever. And it really does help you feel less sore. It's bomb. You need to get it on Amazon. Okay, pre-workout. So I wasn't taking pre-workout for a long time, but I've recently just got back into it. I just, cause I've been working out in the evenings and just by the end of the day, I'm just really, really tired. I have my daughter, Jaylee, and if you're a mom, you know how much that zaps your energy to be home with your kids all day. I mean, people think stay at home moms don't do anything. We do things, taking care of a wild one. Anyways, been taking pre-workout again. I just picked a sub of Walgreens, nothing special. Cheap, it was like 16 bucks. Pre-workout explosion, um, gives me energy. It's pink lemonade flavor, fuels muscle growth and performance, explosive muscle pumps, extreme energy, focus and intensity. I don't know about that, but it gives me energy to push through my workouts and gets me fired up. I will say though, taking it at night, so I take it around 7 usually, it has been keeping me up a little bit later than I usually am, so it's like about midnight. I used to go to bed at like 10.30, but this is kind of keeping me up later, but I gotta do my workouts, so. Okay, so if you guys know me, or most fit people, we don't really drink anything besides water, so that's where I found these. And they have changed my life. Okay, not really, but they're bomb. So I don't drink Gatorade and sugary drinks and soda and whatever else people think is healthy. Well, I know no one thinks soda is healthy, but I don't drink juice because it's full of sugar. So is Gatorade. And most of the zero drinks or diet drinks have a lot of artificial sweeteners in them, which I try to do minimal amounts of. So I found these, and they're these Noon tablets. The, the citrus ones are my fave, the berry one's okay, but, so we got orange, we got lemon lime, I had another citrus one, and then triple berry. But they are fizzy, and it has like electrolytes in it, so like if you're sweating, and you're working out hard, and you, you want something besides water, and give you a little boost of energy. This stuff, pop one in your drink, check it. They're little tablets, like kind of like an Alka-Seltzer. You just pop it in your little, in your cup. And then it starts getting fizzy. This Legion Athletics Phoenix Fat Burner, which I'm trying to cut some weight right now. Well, I'm trying to cut fat and uh, slim up a little bit. So I thought I would give this a try, which I've used it before, and it gives you more energy, more fat loss, fewer cravings. Um, it's caffeine free, but they say it's best if you take it with caffeine. It says, helps you burn fat in three different ways. It dramatically increases metabolic speed. It amplifies the power of fat burning chemicals produced by your body and increases the feeling of fullness from food. Mm-hmm. Which it does. If you want to lose fat faster and experience the type of fat burning power that only clinically effective dosages of scientifically validated ingredients can deliver, and if you want to do it without pumping yourself full of stimulants or potentially harmful drugs, then you want to try Phoenix today. Is that good for a commercial? <laughs> it does 
speed of my metabolism give me a little bit of energy. It gives me a, not like crazy energy and I don't feel like like I'm not cracked out or anything, which I've never done crack, so I don't know how that feels, but I'm just saying. I can imagine. I like it. I'll put the link for it below. Last but not least is my paleo protein, so I am dairy intolerant. I don't know if it's just lactose or whatever else in dairy, but I've tried lactose free and I still get like, I call it bubble guts. It gives me like rumbly tummy, gas, and just like upset stomach every time I eat dairy. Doesn't matter what it is, lactose free. I don't know what it is about dairy, but it's just not sitting well with my stomach. So I can't do whey protein or whey caseinate or whatever. Any of the milk stuff I can't do. So I switched to egg white protein. This is pretty good. It has 21 grams of protein for one scoop and it's only 100 calories. So this is the maple or glazed donut flavor. It tastes like coffee to me. I don't know why. <laughs> I actually had my cousin taste it. I was like, taste this, what's it taste like? And he tasted it and he's like, it tastes like coffee. It tastes like mocha flavor. So I don't know if I just like got a bag that was, they accidentally sent me, they put the wrong flavor in there or if glazed donuts are supposed to taste like coffee. Every glazed donut I have never tasted like coffee, but whatever. And it's egg white protein, natural donut flavor, which is vanilla and maple extract. Lu Han Gao, monk fruit, that's what sweetens it. And then they put a little bit of probiotics in here. Produra, that says uh, now with probiotics, which is cool. I got this off Amazon. If you get the unflavored one, it's like $20 cheaper, or 15 bucks cheaper. I just usually just put a little cocoa powder, but I wanted to try the flavored one. So I did. Okay, watch this, watch this. Okay, this arm looks way better, but it's just the lighting, okay? Yeah! 